Just a little more on magnetic declination here and how you can find it for your area. I mentioned on my Basic Map and Compass DVD that you can do a, a Google search on magnetic declination. And one of the top sites that, that shows up here is this NOAA website, National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, uh, U.S. government website. And uh, it, it's really very good. There's some a lot of information. It's sort of dense in places, uh, but it has some some really good maps here that you can look at. It'll help you visualize where declination is uh, east and where it's uh, west declination. And you can also compute your declination. And I did a little uh, demonstration of this. You you can enter your zip code here. I'll enter my hometown eight six zero one eight and uh, get location and your location pops up over here in latitude and longitude and if you calculate the declination based on that lat long it will tell you that it's about uh, 10 degrees 59 minutes which is about 11 degrees east declination so this is the number you want to use to set your uh, adjustable declination screw on your folding mirror compass and you want to make sure that it's east okay now there is another website I found here that's that's really neat it's called magnetic-declination.com and what's cool about this website is you have this interactive map and so you can uh, you can go anywhere in the world here and click on a location I'll go ahead and click on Flagstaff here and this little box pops up and it tells you what your latitude and longitude is that's great you can double check that make sure it's right and it says the declination here is, a, is going to be 10 degrees <clears throat> 55 minutes east or about 11 degrees east declination and this is this is really good it also tells you that that's positive declination and what that means is uh, that you have to add 10 or 11 degrees in this case it's another piece of information so that you don't have to remember which direction to uh, to turn the screw uh, so you're going to turn the screw your your base plate compass uh, should have east written on one side so that when you when you adjust the, the compass screw your little red box that your needle goes into moves to the east um, but it's also increasing in in a value so you're going from zero degrees which is north to about 11 degrees so you're adding 11 degrees now if I was over here somewhere uh, in on the East Coast let's say we're hiking in, around in Vermont you're going to want to, to adjust your declination to minus 14 degrees west so here you have three pieces of information there's a minus sign it says west it also says negative it's telling you Hey, subtract 14 and a half degrees. Make sure that red box beneath your needle goes to the west. It goes 14 degrees um, left of 360 or due north. So what's 360 minus 14 degrees? That's uh, 346, right? Okay. 